Um, so, um, our project mainly focuses on a residential planning as our given plot uh, um, is situated in a central position. And through some researches and conferences, uh, we got to know that um, life in Indonesia is quite based on uh, sharing values and moments, uh, both uh, uh, with family uh, as well as um, with neighbors. And for this reason, some areas um, are thought to interact with um, the bordering plots. And as you can see from uh, the scheme, um, our plot is divided into two main parts. Uh, this one on the left is private, more private. And um, the other one on the right side is uh, public. Uh, that's because um, on the right side of uh, the um, of the plot, um, there is a river. And so uh, these buildings are more accessible um, for people. And the three public buildings um, are um, a, a wash uh, house, which can be also um, a public um, public square covered uh, public square, and um, there is a bar, and the other one is a cultural center, and we decided to, to design these um, these buildings because um, also in the plot uh, near us. Uh, we have a uh, church, mosques, um, markets, and uh, even a kindergarten. So um, we thought that uh, these uh, three could be a meeting point and as a reference for people. Um, in order to create our project, the structure and the Uber concept uh, of Venice were taken uh, as a reference and especially um, its little courtyards and its mm, calli, which are um, typical small Venice streets. Um, and um, therefore, we wanted to create, um, to recreate the feeling of uh, community, uh, also through a system of courtyards, which are more or less permeable, depending on, on their position uh, on the plot. And um, they also establish a network of relationships, um, both with uh, both in the private sphere um, and in in the one of the neighborhood. And hence the title Goyub, um, which we thought it could be um, quite um, um, appropriate to to our concept. Um, and furthermore, um, the theme of pathways uh, is uh, enhanced by uh, some grooves uh, in the ground and uh, also water basins, uh, which run through the plot, and they also get in private spaces. Um, and uh, they also manage to, to drain uh, rainwaters. Um, as uh, rain and, um, and water are particularly important for um, Indonesia, um, we wanted to, to make it um, guide on external walls, um, defining also uh, different colors and reflections um, as they get in contact with, uh, with the polyurethane surface. Okay. Um, apartments interiors uh, are adapted uh, to the different dimension of the AMA, but with uh, the same approach, uh, um, absence of uh, internal uh, of partition wall uh, only for the bathroom uh, to create uh, um, wide uh, flexible spaces where people can enjoy their time and uh, bed raised uh, and uh, steps uh, uh, to create more usable space. Um, okay. uh, 
。早安。Yeah, some problems. Okay. Um, in the double height buildings, uh, we have placed uh, um, some uh, mezzanines. You can see here. Um, bigger or smaller, usable uh, uh, like an uh, other bed. Uh, um, a study area or a relax area. And uh, cultural center is another place uh, where we wanted to leave maximum freedom of choice uh, about uh, the activities uh, to be carried out. So also here uh, there aren't internal um, septa and uh, the stained glass windows uh, Mm, aren't um, and uh, the and um, the stained glass windows uh, along the entire length uh, of the long sides uh, along the total opening. Uh, uh, toward the outside, uh, taking advantages of uh, the garden. Um, on on this um, on uh, this side, uh, um, we have also placed uh, steps uh, to invite people. Uh, to stop and leave the space uh, around um, around a water basin that you can see. So here we see our uh, diorama. Uh, can you go back to the other altar tavola, Maddie? So here we have uh, our diorama, which uh, evaluate, uh, evaluates uh, our idea of blocks. Uh, indeed, uh, we uh, deleted the distinction between uh, roof and walls in order to create these blocks, uh, these white blocks. Uh, we wanted to create uh, motion uh, uh, thanks to the window. Uh, because uh, in order to uh, to make uh, different perception on the viewer. Indeed, uh, you can see groups uh, of windows uh, as well as uh, singular ones. In order to um, evaluate this idea of motion, we decided to introduce some uh, wood, some sunscreens, which uh, create uh, other, uh, more plays uh, of light uh, and, uh, and shadows uh, on uh, the elevation. Uh, talking uh, about uh, the materials, uh, we um, wanted to use uh, polyurethane in order to create, uh, uh, in order to evaluate the theme of water, because uh, as Federica said, um, this material is really uh, reflective and uh, uh, when water uh, slides uh, on it, uh, uh, it creates uh, uh, these uh, streaks uh, which are uh, more reflective. Uh, here we put uh, our reference uh, on the top, uh, which uh, um, really uh, explains what uh, I have just said. Uh, then, talking uh, about the structure, we used the uh, uh, XLAM for the vertical parts uh, because we do not uh, um, have uh, such big openings. And uh, for the roof, uh, roofs, which uh, are bent, we decided to use a um, structure made of uh, uh, beams and joists which are, of course, uh, bent in order to support uh, uh, our structure. And uh, that's it.